Hello everyone, I am the Dino Gamer and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World Primal Ops. So as you can see, I played a little bit earlier today, so now we're on the last mission of chapter 2. This will be to subdue the wild dinosaur. I'm guessing it will be a Sukumimus. But before we do this, we have some quests to collect. Like this, that, and lastly this. 1800 coin, 800 dino XP, and 500 handler XP, and 100 keys. And with those 100 keys, we can open one crate, one common dinosaur crate. Open, let's see what we get. We got one legendary DNA and two rare, five rare DNA. Now, we can level up some of our dinosaurs like Acrocanthosaurus. So, I'll level him up to level 20. That didn't cost too much. Power 350. And it does. 20 damage, chump. We got a reward, pretty nice. We can't rank up unfortunately, we're just one DNA away. However, we can rank up Sukumimus. So let's do that, it costs 5000 coin. It does a significant boost to all stats. Now we can level up to level 10 or 20. Level 20 Sukumimus. It does 9 damage, but it does attack pretty fast. I want a great shield on because I find it pretty useless, at least for now. We did complete some achievements, we get 2 DNA there, and 3 DNA here, and another 2. Great. Uh, we also did some more quests. So we got 10 Amber, and 5 Rare. DNA. Nice. Let's hop right into the last mission of chapter 2. We receive reports of a wild Sukumimus in the area. Be careful, she's scared and might attack. Let's hop right into it. Hmm, a jungle biome this time. It was desert for all of chapter 2. Let's stand back, let's summon Antarctica Felter. Wait a little bit and then summon Sukumimus. <laughs> That's run, 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 run. Titanosaurus to help. Oh, run, run, run. I keep missing the run button. I think it's half health. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Around in circles, around in circles. Antarctica Pelta. That should protect me. No. Out of stamina, out of stamina, out of stamina. Super minus. It appears to be running away. Nope, nope, nope. I'm almost dead. Sukumimus again. Oh no. This is not good. Fantastic Pelta. Again, again, again. It's almost dead. Almost dead. I don't think. Nope. Nope. Still alive. 
They're alive. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out. Get out. It's so close to being dead. Fantastic propellers up. Yes. We did it. We got this box that I cannot collect. Nope. I, I'm not sure if I collected a box. It, it looks so. I hope I did. If I didn't, that would not be too nice. Hmm. Not too many good stuff. Some great gonna upgrades though. Maybe they'll help. But there you have it. Chapter 2 is complete. On to chapter 3. And I believe with chapter 3, we unlock those DNA events. We're on chapter 3. Let's see. I be we did another achievement. We got some pretty average rewards. But now I believe we can do events. Is that crack? Hmm. Only some, I think. Maybe. Complete normal difficulty for that event. Oh, I have to complete chapter 3. I see now. Squad. It looks like mini missions. How do we do this? Deploy. Interesting. So it's one. Let's see how that works next episode. Still can't upgrade the trunk revolver though. Can't upgrade the control rifle so why not? We can't upgrade the character actually. Level 15. Quite a bit more health and a lot of power. That will be really useful in battle. To end it off, let's go to events. And let's do our daily supplies. We get blueprints. We actually need that. I like to switch out. Actually, this is the strongest team possible, so I guess I'll go with it. I wanted to use Acrocanthosaurus. And here we are in the DLE supplies mission for blueprints. It's the same as always. Seven waves to collect the rewards. There we have the tower. Time to kill some bad guys. Antarctic the Pelta. Hack the satellite tower. This should be easy, especially with Super Mimus's upgrade. We're actually getting a lot of blueprints. This one, nice. We're already on wave 4. We're getting certain significant amounts of blueprints from this, so maybe we can upgrade our gunner. I mean, the gun of guy holds. Wave 5. Going pretty good. One more left for this wave, power on wave 6. I lost almost no health yet. 
Super Mario Bros. has been amazing. Titan Research is basically an, a weaker version of Antarctica Pelta. It doesn't really do much. Last wave now. Someone Antarctica Pelta run around this. Summon Super Mimus. Titanosaurus, because why not? Two guys with shield here. Instantly dead. And that's it. Let me just run around, make sure I did not leave any blueprints behind. Doesn't look so. And let's complete our mission. And we've gotten quite a lot of upgrades. Wonder if we'll be able to upgrade anybody. Sorry, I meant blueprints. I said upgrades earlier. We got quite a lot of blueprints. Handlers. We still can't upgrade our gunner. And we don't unlock anything else for a while. Level 31 to unlock the medkit. Same for this guy. Can't upgrade his gun either. Well, that should be it for this video. Join me next time where we'll be doing Chapter 3, Mission 1. Which will be disarming a dino trap. And still can't use African Dosaurus, unfortunately. But we have a pretty strong Sukumimus. Thanks for watching and bye for now.